do again. We're right in the book as well. We're right in the book. I didn't see that. I didn't see that last time. <sighs> Apparently seven generations have been baptized, one, one generation after another, uh, in this font. It will be older than that. There will be a font older than that, but that was the top half was 1672. Oh, look at that. I didn't fancy that. Chances going up that ladder, do you? To get in the tower. I would probably do it. I would probably do it. Oh, I can feel the ancestors, you know. I can. I, I, mean, I was so... Well, the first time I found this place, I was really sort of... Um, Overcome with emotion, really. Right, that might that might be um, an old Bible there. Right. No, it's not. Like in Setra, they had two old Bibles. Oh, there's one there. I think this was here before this one. Very old, isn't it? Like a very old door. Look. It's just not a lot of money here. And here we've got the statues. I was just trying to find out about this, uh, why this thing. Nobody seems to know they've written why um, th this flower pot holder was put on here. In gratitude for lasting friendship, Grace starting Walsh, Naomi... F um, Phillips Holmes descend oh yeah Grace Stoning Walsh was a descendant of William Oak who died in 1752 of Burr Green and Naomi Phillips Holm descendant of Elizabeth de Burr and she died in 1421 but we nobody knows exactly why that was I said there, there will be hidden meanings in some of the pillars and other things. The old beams, look. The old statues that have been here a long, long time and they'll be here a long time after I've gone. I don't know if there'll ever be anyone else coming from my side of the tree to, to do this, I don't know. It'd be nice to think someone would be interested. I'm going to put the flowers in a minute. Look at these tiles, these old bricks, look. They look... Well, they're functional, aren't they? Functional. Needs a lot of work still doing. It's just finding the money, isn't it? To be quite honest, it's finding the money. I mean, look at that old chest there. The original chest. Of course, everything would just rot or go damp. Um, things like that. Yeah, 500 years and plus of ancestors. And of course, we've traced back through time to connections with the De Beers, put it that way, through the De Clares. Well, let's put it this way. Um, Stetchworth has really had a massive makeover. 300,000 was spent on it. Um, Burr Green had a lot spent on it as well. So, um, it's a beautiful church, so.
To the glory of God, this tablet and clock on the school has been erected in grateful memory of the men of this parish who gave their lives in the Great War. You've got Buller, Burgess, Blake, Copin, Ewers, Grass, Jaggard, Mingay, Pledger, Smith, Starling, 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 Turner, Wallace and Woolard. 1914 to 1919 war they got there. I thought it was always to 1918. Right, we just we just have a little walk up towards the aisle. It's funny that you come in through there. No, normally you would come in through there, wouldn't you? Then go up towards the aisle like this. My ancestors, this is the way they would have come. When they were young, and their coffins would have been brought here as well. Stephen Oak, Edward Oak and their wives would have been positioned in front of the altar like this. I expect this space was ransacked during Cromwell's time. But it was. I always think the thing is I do feel sad because it needs more work done on it. Really, doesn't it? But it's still standing. It's still standing. Right, over and over the video, folks.